So this is Eric uh, Flores and he is 23 years old. Yo soy Leslie Sanchez, tengo 21. And this is his wife Leslie Sanchez and she's 21 years old. Y el bebé es Kelly, es la más caliente, regalado. And then their baby that you saw is Caleb. He is seven months old. Últimamente, pues nosotros vivíamos de renta y es difícil porque la situación está muy complicada. A veces llegan y sacan sus cosas. Como ahorita. Sí, sí, sí. So she said they really need a house because they are renting, but then they have to move from place to place all the time. And that's just hard to take out all their furniture and move all your stuff every single time that you need it back. Pastor Leticia was telling us that yesterday, the person owning their house asked for it back. So they had to move all their furniture and everything here into their mom's house and live here for a while until they can find a place to rent if they choose to move out. But just moving around and paying rent has been a struggle for them. Um, and especially we can say that this week. Espiritualmente, porque es una bendición, gracias a, a la ayuda de Casas por Cristo y porque los marcos nuestros hijos que lo necesitan. She said spiritually this house would be a great blessing. Um, she said thank you to Casas por Cristo for making this possible. She said especially for our son, uh, for him to have a great place to grow up in, we really want this house for him. <laughs> he said it'll just be great. It's an emotional thing to be able to, and an exciting thing to receive this house. Buenos días, este mi nombre es Leticia Cuevas. She says, good morning, I'm Pastor Leticia Cuevas and my church is John 316 here in Kilometer 30 in this part of the world. Bueno, yo la elegí primeramente por lo espiritual, ¿verdad? Porque, pues, todos necesitamos de Dios y ellos como matrimonio recién empiezan, pues necesitan, ¿verdad? La ayuda de Dios. ¿verdad? para que sean guiados en su matrimonio. Segundo, porque pues no tienen una casa propia. Uh -huh. Estaban rentando ahí enfrente de la iglesia y el día de ayer les dijeron, ¿sabe qué? Bye, ya no queremos que estén aquí. Uh -huh. Les pidieron la casa, sacaron sus muebles y pues ahorita se vinieron aquí con su mamá. Uh -huh. Entonces pues les surge pues sí una casita para poder ellos este she said, I chose this family first for spiritual reasons. She said, this is a new couple and they're Christians just like us, um, but they're starting out their, their marriage together and also with their new baby. And she said they really need God's help in this time. So spiritually, she wanted to be a help to them. And also she said physically they need a place of their own. Like we said yesterday, they were asked to move out of the house they were renting in. They had to move all their furniture, move, move completely out, and then move into this house that we're filming this in today. And this is a parents, a, one of their parents' houses. Um, so just the physical need and having a home of their own is also the second reason why she chose this family. Bueno, pues el resultado que yo espero es de que sigan buscando de Dios, ¿verdad? Porque una casa no lo es todo. Eh, sabemos, ¿verdad?, que todo esto es pasajero y, y lo más importante es seguir a Cristo, seguir buscando de Dios, que Dios cada día impacte sus vidas, sus almas, sus corazones, para que ellos les sigan siendo fiel a Dios. She said she hopes that as a result, they will continue pursuing God and, and following hard after God. She said she hopes that every day they would be able to be impacted by God and His Word, keep growing closer to Him, seeing Him move in their life, um, and just grow, grow stronger as Christians. She said a house is not everything. We hope that spiritually they are impacted by this house, that they will continue to grow in their faith and grow just deeper with God. Yeah.